Well, hello, friends, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we are in Reese Blitzville. That's where we're at. So, it is a beautiful Friday afternoon here. Sun's out, but it's not super hot. It's probably like 78, which has been awesome compared to the like 90, 95 that we've had. You know, it's been hot. But I've got all of this big oak that you saw probably in the last video that I worked up with the bobcat and the splitter on the front of it. I've uh, moved the pile and I've already split about two face cords off of it in the last few weeks. But today it's finally cooled down enough and I'm going to get it worked up. Get a, Hopefully I get at least two done. Today I'll be using the Easton Mid Ultra with the four-way wedge. And uh, four-way works pretty good. Sometimes I wish I had the single on it, but a lot of times four-way is real good on it. I've been using that four-way a lot lately. And then I've got the Bobcat MT100 and then the big firewood bucket. So uh, if you've seen my videos before, I'm gonna split into the bucket and then I'm going to take it and stack it. I could split it loose into totes, but I just like having everything neat and stacked and organized. So I've got the time. I don't do a ton of wood, so I'll do it this way. Let's get this thing fired up and let's get going.
Well guys, I got a little dent put in the pile there and the bucket is heaping full. That's oak firewood there, boys. So I'm gonna take it right over there and we're gonna stack it, so let's go. So here is some oak that I split a couple weeks ago. All right, that's half a face cord, half a rick of green red oak and uh, stacked it out of the bucket. Now I said the same thing when I had my tractor, but I tell you what, I could not do firewood without this loader because I hate stacking. If I was bending over, grabbing that off the ground and then stacking it, my back would be dead. But stacking from waist height, having something held right where you need it, it makes life so easy. So I'm gonna pull it back over here and we're gonna get back to stacking. But we're not gonna get back to stacking, we're gonna get back to splitting. Done. Last bucket stacked and I'm back and I took my mini excavator and I sorted through that pile and kind of got the pieces that I wanted to split with the four-way out of it moved over here and uh, I don't know it works pretty good because when I push this up uh, I still fall for the same dumb stuff that I should have learned from but when you push it up you just throw crap all in it and I hate picking out crap so pick stuff out set it over here I set some single way wedge stuff over there and I'm gonna get splitting hopefully this is enough to fill another tote and that'll probably be it for today
All right, I've refreshed my stock there and I decided to put the single wedge on because on some of this big wood, it's just easier to single it and then like kind of quarter it up and then just slide it back and forth through rather than the four way where pieces just kind of fall all over. So the four way is perfect for, I don't know, 12, 12 inch wood, 16 inch wood at the biggest, probably eight to 12 is what it's really good at. Uh, but this single, it's, I think I'm gonna really like it on this bigger stuff, we'll see. It's gonna take a little bit longer, but I think it'll be pleasing to use. I'm the kind of person that I'm okay with the task taking longer as long as I enjoy doing it and uh, it's fun to do. So let's get after it. another bucket full I got a little bit left over there but that should definitely top off my second basket over there so that'll give me two full face cords that I split and stacked tonight so is it the most productive night nah but I got something done so good little workout so there we go two face cords of oak split we got something done everything worked real nice and I would say I've got probably on the ground Probably another face quarter or two worth of the oak to split and then I've got all that pile of limbs and stuff to cut up and run through. Thanks for watching guys. We'll see you next time. Have a good one.